minutes on Thursday and a quick turnaround just Saturday to, to prepare for this matchup. The Bears, meanwhile, the ball's brought up by Sarah Andrews, bringing two transfers in the guard position, but all eyes in the post. The weight trophy winner, Melissa Smith, number one, and Queen Angbo, that high-low post. The double team comes, not enough. I mean, a lot doing things a certain way. Absolutely, and it's going to be pro level is what she's bringing to Baylor in terms of the philosophies, especially on the defensive end. And we'll get more into that as the game extends, but Nikki Khan is so excited about her new role here as the head coach. Smith is able to get away just shots to guard in the game because everyone's trying to funnel in and close the paint. Debbie, no good from the baseline. Melissa Smith with yet another rebound. And she, Melissa Smith is the Big 12 preseason player of the year recipient. And she will knock down Lord have mercy. That's what that was. Whoa, what? Ashley Owusu, my goodness. Was she driving the bus on that one down the lane? Whoa. Melissa Smith. I don't know if you can answer. That three up and in. And, and she is playing fantastically. She's two of four from three right now for Maryland. But she just knows when to relocate to behind the arc. You could just feel that she wanted that opportunity back as Smith spins and Finnecker. I was at some of their open practices earlier this season, and I don't think she missed from the outside when I saw her. That's continued into the season. They still have six players averaging double figures, but sometimes their stats, if you look at last season, it looks like fantasy status. <laughs> down to Nalissa Smith. Beautiful. Queen Egbo as well, just to calm that situation down a little bit. Yeah, she should have. She, Nikki Coleman has three teenagers as well, so she understands. <laughs> Brim Freeze, two twin boys, moms are here. <laughs> but this is such a big matchup for both of these teams. A lot of emotions. It's Melissa Smith right back to the locker room. Well, now Maryland down to seven active players for the remainder of this game so far. Unless Miller comes back, which we will keep you posted on. Benzin, Faith, Masonis both out with an illness as Melissa last year shooting nearly 60%. And you see that on plays like that where it's anywhere near the paint. Good probability it's fallen through. She's got 70 heavily contested or highly skilled post moves, really complicated footwork. Rebound to Sarah Andrews pushing it up the floor. 3.30 to go. In the third quarter at Xfinity Center, lobbing inside. And Melissa Smith has scored the last seven points for Baylor. Back to a 10-point contest. 1-2-2 two, two again for Maryland, looking to trap it. A little smoother time breaking it as Lewis. Crowd looking for a travel there as Melissa Smith continues. Waiting for a kick out. And there are two players in there. And with the three fouls, Going into that play, you got to kick that out. And now Angel Reese has to take a seat with those four fouls for Maryland. And she is the only player on the bed. And Melissa Smith protected that one like Tim Duncan with both hands, one under, one on top. It was tough. Another board for the Wade Trophy winner, and she goes back off season with soreness in her knee. Played 10 minutes today after making her season debut on Thursday, and then appeared. Our first year Baylor coach, Nikki Collin. Head fake for Smith. She can't get it to go. Staying here with Andrews, a tremendous rebounding guard. Lewis.